So I've got my dream air source heat pump for my koi pond um, and I'm not happy with the uh, controller on it, I don't think it's been accurate enough. So we've got one of these um, HTC, STC sorry, 1000 controllers. I'm going to try and fit that to it now in this video. So first step, I've got this outdoor box um, which is deep enough for this to sit in. We've drawn a template out and I'm just going to train, chain drill around this template uh, and then file it square so that this can fit through the lid. Uh, it is an outdoor box, of course I'm not mounting it outdoors because it's not all going to be uh, watertight. So this is going to go in the shed with the uh, fi filter and the rest of the electrics. So next step now, drill this out so that this can slip in and then we'll look at the wiring. Big. Okay, that's it. Let's have a look. Where's my dad? Filing a, um, a lid. Okay, so we've cut a hole in the lid, and now that can fit. Oops, sorry. A bit difficult doing this one handed. But that can fit now nicely flush against there. And then those pink clips are going to slide down the back to trap it in place. Okay, so the next step is the wiring, and I'm a bit conscious about doing this now because it's starting to go dark. So we're going to get a crack on with this. Uh, first of all, take off all the self-tapping nuts, and then we're going to access the dream and wire all this up. Okay, so we're in the uh, control panel, or the electronics section, and what we're going to do now is we're going to pick up a live and neutral and an earth, from this section here, so we're literally going to tap into that and uh, take another connection off that and then we're also going to come over here and you can see there that there is, this is all of course disconnected so there's nothing connected to mains now we're going to remove this loop here so you can see there's a small white wire which is looped from this connection to this connection we're going to remove that and in a second you'll see where that connects onto the STC controller. So we're going to remove that loop now. Okay, the lighting is really bad, but I've removed the loop that you can see from my uh, previous video there. And then I've wired the neutral to the uh, bottom and the live to the top. So I'm just going to point to that there. So I appreciate the light's really bad. But these two here, basically the blue neutral at the bottom and the brown live at the top. And I've also connected <laughs> chat, connected the live and neutral there as well. Electrician. Electrician. Okay, so, okay, so I'm wiring up the controller and you've got on the far left there you've got power supply, live then neutral, then you've got the probe which you can put in any direction, and then you've got the heating, going to the heating relay live and then neutral. Okay, so we're going to screw this up now. The box is on the wall. We're going to screw this up. You can see it's getting dark outside uh, and then we're going to turn it on. Okay, some success. I've just um, turned it on, uh, powered up the heat pump and this has come on. So the next thing is just to figure out how to actually uh, go into the settings and set this.